The start of the 21st century signalled a turnaround for the nursing profession in regards to technology. Improvements in technology such as the internet, smart devices and artificial intelligence has changed the way the healthcare industry works dramatically. One of the biggest advancements recently is the development of genetic testing and genome sequencing. Research shows that human genome discoveries have the power to change the face of healthcare from one that fixed people after they were sick to one of preventative diagnostic medicine. Knowledge about one's genetic sequence has a so-called predictive value about it and is one of the reasons why genetic testing is becoming so popular in today's society. Having knowledge about your genetic sequence will give you information about your susceptibility to certain diseases, which allows you to become proactive in trying to not contract the disease. For example, Duchenne's muscular dystrophy, or DMD, is an inherited disorder caused by a defective gene for dystrophin, a protein in the muscles that causes rapid deterioration of muscle strength, usually during early childhood. 15-year-old Vincent Peterson is your average teen. He goes to Coon Rapids High School and loves to play video games. He's also facing some not-so-average challenges. I have spinal muscular atrophy. There's a lot of different muscular dystrophy. Being able to diagnose a child with DMD comes from being able to identify this missing gene. Research shows that a child with DMD will usually have a mother with a carrier gene and the diagnosis of the child with DMD is often the first time the family will be made aware of this. From there, this information will impact the family's decision about whether or not to have more children, since there's almost a 50-50 chance of another child developing DMD. There is a similar case for what the media calls the breast cancer gene, BRCA1 and BRCA2. About 10% of breast cancer cases are made up of women who have this gene present in their DNA. Being a carrier of this gene increases your chances of developing breast cancer significantly and because of this, knowing that you carry a positive gene opens up options for preventative treatments well before there is time for cancer to develop. More and more women are choosing to be tested for the gene following a family history of breast cancer, either for peace of mind or so that they can take advantage of the preventative measures that are becoming readily available. Preventative medicine is starting to become the norm, which is slowly changing the nursing profession. Since nurses have to act as patient advocates and educators, they must also be educated and up to date with the most recent, most effective and best options for their patients. By using DMD and the BRCA genes as examples, we can see how genetics affects the families, and not only those that carry the gene. Many families who carry genes for diseases choose not to have children for fear that their child will also inherit the gene. As even more information is found out about genetics, eventually people will be able to design their own babies. Almost in the same way you would design a clay piece, moulding and sculpting it until you are certain that it is okay to be fired in the kiln. This means parents can have children without the worry of them developing diseases such as DMD and the breast cancer gene plus many, many more. Not everyone realises how much technology has impacted nursing and the healthcare field, especially in recent years. Genetics is just one of the fields that has benefited the most. However, many more areas of healthcare have technology to thank for the rising success rates in prevention, diagnosis, treatment and prognosis that are only predicted to continue increasing.